Yes guys, welcome back to another video on the channel now. Today we have my biggest squad builder yet. I've done many squad builders on the channel, they seem to do pretty well. But today is 1.6 million coins worth. Um, pretty mental. I'm going to do it a bit different. I'm going to flip through all the players without showing you the team as a whole. So, um, And then we'll show it obviously at the end of going through the players and we'll play a game. Just see what it's like. Um, yeah, pretty much. If you haven't seen my other video it was on 3-5-2 formation, you've got to check that out first because that's that they're the tactics for this. It starts off in a 5-3-2 and not everyone is on cam. I want to say that. This is my, my ultimate team. So ultimately I make the decisions and I play a few players off cam. So if you don't like that, then yeah, um, I guess. I don't know. You'll have to deal with it. But it is a very good squad. So in goes Laurie, six foot two, and these sorts of stats. It's a keeper. I don't think it really matters. But he is a very good keeper. I do think he is a good keeper. Um, but a lot of keepers are good on the game. A lot of keepers are bad, but this one's a good one. Anyway, right wing back he plays. Well, he plays in game as a th uh, right mid. Um, but it's uh, Rafinha, the informed version. I packed him untradeable. 87 games, 20 goals as a right mid, and the 3 5 2 isn't bad. Um, left footed, 4 star, 4 star very very good stats as well, there they are agility and balance are up there and then rapid, good stamina so he lasts quite a long time, good dribbling dribbling is his main thing I'd say um, yeah, very very well, and pace obviously and then, in at right centre back in game as well um, is going to be Eda Militao a very overpowered player 80, uh, 83 pace with 83 defending, 80 physical with an anchor as well, so adds plus fives and tens everywhere in those departments is very very nice um he's just so overpowered he always is isn't he next player huge icon if you if you missed my base icon pack there's a spoiler that is what is what uh what it came from he's he's good i do like him bit short five foot nine but apart from that he's uh, he's exceptional his defending is well 99 defensive awareness and stand tackle and slide tackle uh with the Guardian, is it? Guardian Kemsar? Yep, Guardian. And then loads of agility and balance on a centre-back. Very, very nice to have. And then, yeah, rapid as well. 95 jump in, so makes up for the height. And then Kempembe, another 80-plus centre-back pace. Sorry, um, yeah, left-footed. It's key to have a left-footed and left centre-back. I think it really, really helps. And um, I play with him 300 games. Honestly, I can't see myself dropping him. He's so, so good. Um, that's how good he is, pretty much. He, he stayed in my team. Just really good defending and physical, and then rapid as well for a centre back. In at left mid, the biggest player in the team, Neymar Jr. I bought him, and he is incredible. Five star skills, five star weak foot, uh, nine games, eight goals, six assists from right striker in a 3 5 2. 5 5 9 paid, and I think he's already dropped to 5 3. But um, you've got to pick him up. He's so good. There's the stats. They don't, they don't uh, do him justice because he is amazing. He is so good. Anyway, plays left mid in the 3-5-2. Vinicius Jr. red in form. Things about 250k or even more. High medium. He doesn't score a lot, but he is involved uh, due to his pace and dribbling pretty much. He's almost maxed out pace with 5-star skills, 4-star weak foot. Not the best shooting, but dribbling and pace. Like Rafinha, get down the line or cut inside. They're both really good at both of those things. And yeah. In at Cam then, we have got... I guess he's not... Uh, a cam in the 5-3-2 but he plays cam at 3-5-2 uh, in game 4 star skill moves 3 star weak foot um, high high don't think I noticed that 5 foot 8 left footed and then those sorts of stats I have loved him didn't I use him like first 5 games I thought he's not that good now he's just he's been insane well there's his stats for me that's incredible from 92 games as a cam uh, yeah I don't notice the guess you could say lack of pace um but he's so good at dribbling and shooting, so he makes up for it. And that's why I love him. And then CDM, one of the CDMs is Tillemans, UEL, Road to Knockouts. Five-star weak foot is perfect on him. Four-star skill moves. I've got him to stay back while attacking, so he doesn't really get up. That's why he's not scored. And really well-rounded. That is why he's in the team. And then next to him in CDM is Bruno Fernandes. Um, he's a bowler. He is a bowler. Um, I've loved using him on tradable. Force our skill moves high high. He gets he is a high high in my team as well. He gets up and down, so really really fun to use. That's why I get some goal contributions. Ninety one stamina, last ages. Yeah, he's he's awesome. Great great little card. And then bit of a dead one. 
but he's actually good. 66 games, 27 goals and 30 assists. So 57 contributions, 66 games from 83 Jesus. Now it's 1.6 million team and Jesus is in it. I could get his inform, but he'd be off cam. Maybe I'll do it, maybe I don't. Um, but I sub him off a lot. So um, to get those contributions in that amount of games, they're not full games, definitely not. He gets subbed off most games. So um, that is pretty impressive if you ask me. And with a sniper, he's a baller. So there's the team as it is full. Um, I often bring on like Rodrigo up front or Dembele and then Fakir at, at Cam and stuff. So you can kind of see where I where I switch things about. And then this is what it looks like. Like I said, players off Cam. Jesus is there for the Cam as well. Um, could get like Sterling off Cam or someone, but no need. And I could get. I know I can get more Cam if I do this, but. I don't fancy the position change expenses. So Tillemans on 8 is fine for me. Um, I think that is pretty much it. Apart from the tactics, which definitely go check out. They'll be up there. No, up there. Up there is where the tactics will be. Um, this is what I play in game pretty much. You can copy, pause the video, copy them, or watch the video. And that is it in game. Uh, Neymar up front with Jesus, Bernardo Silva, Cam, left mids. Vinicius, right mid, Rafinha, Tillemans and Fernandez, uh, CDMs and centre backs as they were. And then the CDMs are on cut passing lanes. Well, basically go watch the video. This is what they're on. Um, you can pause on all of that. It is pretty much that. Let's get into a game. Okay then, here's his team, a full prem team, a very nice one as well. Um, no one really bad. Rudiger's still probably okay and Vardy's quick I guess and good shooting. The rest of the team is <clears throat> very, very good. It's going to be a nice game. Hopefully, we can show why this team does so well for me. And I guess he's worth the coins. Um, honestly, I think it would be. 3-5-2 for me has been very, very good. And I stand by it. Probably until you start playing against like pro players and stuff. This is my first game of the day. So, um, it'll be interesting to see how we can do. Got Neymar on the ball. Go on, Bernardo. Nope. Wait, what? He just started running away from the ball. All right, then. Cheers, EA. Ah, oh, there we go. Kimpembe. Good thing is, one centre-back's pushed up. We've still got two, which is what you'd usually have in your formation. And you're never getting past Cannavaro with that sort of shot. Oh, it's still in. Started itching my head thinking it went out, but it just didn't. And that was a poor pass for me. But, yeah, that that is what I like. You can push up, and you've still got players just overlapping everywhere just i think it's just the options really so many options going now i need to focus up because first game on i'm making the worst de decisions ever here we go neymar quick feet and i couldn't find where to go don't know what i was doing to be honest and um, that is not a good challenge he's away but like i said two center backs still should be okay don't want to speak too soon. Rafinha, of all people, to make that final challenge. And he's won it straight back off him. Decent. Good. Kimpembe. Nice lad. Could be away here. Let's get into Jesus. Nice ball. Neymar might be in. Oh, I can't think it over him. Ooh. Good for my lads winning it back. Vinicius making a run out wide. Oh, that is filthy. That is filthy. I literally sent him to the shops there. Bruno, Bruno, Bernardo literally pings it into the side netting, I think. So um, that's one now. That is literally like so many options. That's why I love it. I think that has got to be. If I was to sum it up, it is the options in this formation. Never really. Not often, anyway. Are you stuck from where to go? Obviously, like every formation, you'll have moments where you think, I don't know where I could have gone. But this one seems to just, the f the shape, I mean, everything about it, I like it. That Until it gets patched, I am using it because it is fun. And you can break quickly as well. And I know a lot of people like to do that, including me. And here we go, Jesus, show them why you're still in the team. Bang, easy finish for Jesus, and that's 2-0. There's no way he's quitting. Bang, there we go. 
That is it. That is the 1.6 million team. Demolished a guy in division rivals. Like that. Done. I guess you could say old albinated. You just got albinated, mate. So, uh, yeah. There we go, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash a like if you're new. Subscribe for more FIFA content. And, yeah. I'm out. Peace.